Hi guys, welcome back to the Flat Media channel. Today I'm going to show you how to create this audio spectrum effect. Make sure to watch the video until the end, to learn more about this effect. Before we start make sure to like the video, subscribe to our channel and ring notification bell. As well, go to Elements in Vado and get a subscription. Also, get your Filmora 11 today. Now let's jump into the video. First thing we need to do is to place the audio track. And add the background photo on top. Make sure that it matches the duration of the song so, let's cut it. Now I want to create some movement of the photo. So go to effects, search for filters. Press on it, and click on shake filter, and you'll find the mild shale effect. Add on the photo. I don't want the focus to be on the background, so that's why we'll add some blur. Go to search, and type, square blur, and place it on the photo. Now go to media. I have downloaded particles. Let's add that on top, but one layer higher. Because we need this layer for later. Now shut the volume down. And now to remove the black background. Double click at the particles. Go to compositing, go to blending mode, press on normal, and change it to lighten. Now only the particles will be visible. Now add another photo. Now click on the photo, go to video, and make the scale to 60%. Now go to mask, select the circle. And go down to make the size you want to be the circle. After that go to basic, scroll down, and select the drop shadow. Put the opacity to 100, put the distance to 0, and the blur you make how it matches the best with the photo, and background. Our next step is to create the rotating animation. To do that go to animation, press on customize, and add keyframe on the start. And move all the way to the end. Go to rotate, and make it 360 degrees. It automatically put a keyframe. Now let's add the audio spectrum. Press OK, and go to effects. Go to audio visualizer. We have different video visualizers. Let's use this one. Place on top of everything. Make sure to matches with everything. Now make the spectrum fits the picture. Double click at the effect, and make the radius bigger. Make sure the spectrum fits the picture well. Now let's use another one, go to effect, let's use this one. Place it on the empty layer. It's too high. To adjust it, If it doesn't fit all the way to the edge, increase the scale. Let's put on 1.05. Now put the position where you want. and press Render Preview. And that's it. Again make sure to like the video, subscribe to our channel and ring notification bell. Also get your Filmora 11 today and subscribe to Elements in Vado if you want to become a pro editor.